your data ability has improved. You can now manually attack targets. Second mind about something? Wonderful it is to see you again, pal. Yep. Oh, yay, you still have some quests, my guy. Yep. The snake bite, fella? Again? <laughs> ah! <laughs> you won't believe it. I got bitten again. <laughs> it's real deep. So You're I damn be. lucky uh, I have this. Uh, oh, 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 can't believe I don't carry this with me. Oh. oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. oh, I owe you so much, mister. I can't believe you saved my life twice. Me neither. Well, <laughs> I best be getting back to town. Gonna eat a stiff one tonight. <sighs> That's it. You ain't getting another out. Well, you're good at recovering, at least. <laughs> Don't worry about it.
Where is this fool? Oh my god. Hang in there, old boy. Nothing to fear. All right. They creep up on you, you know. <laughs> Mr. Morgan. How are you? Well, sir. What are you working on? Do you know anything about alligators? Only the basics. Avoid them wherever possible. <laughs> well, did you know that in the last 50 years, we've killed 90%? You say that like it makes you sad. They're beautiful creatures. <laughs> Let's see how you speak when one of them's got you in a death row. Yes, I will make some creature a very happy lunch one of these days. Let's try and avoid that from happening today, hmm? I mean, you stay there, you'll get a great shot, then you'll get eaten. What a way to go. Why don't we take this boat out, and I'll protect you. Come on, get in the boat, he'll be fine. Well, if you really think that's necessary... You carry on shooting from that bank, you're gonna wish them wolves had eaten you. Really? Yes. <clears throat> the ten percent have survived. They're the nasty ones. All right, then. Um... Oh, I saw a movement to the north of us. Oh, and to the west. Oh, and to the northwest, there. That, that's probably where we should look. Let's go look, then. When we find one, line me up so I can get the shot. I'll try. Don't get too close. You'll scare them away. Close, but not too close. Got it. Last year, they brought 10,000 skins out of the swamps of Lemoyne alone. Well, the gators got some catching up to do there. Cases, trunks, shoes, boots, belts, Bibles even. They'll make anything out of gator le Oh, look! On that little beach. Boars! If we're in luck, an alligator won't be far away. The gator! It's got it! Quick, quick! I must get this shot! This one's over there. Just a little turn, please. There'll be no need for an instrument of killing. Now, rotate. Rotate. We caught him. In the middle of his dinner. This is history-making, truly. Nature, in all its glory and cruelty. Could have been you if you stayed on that bank where I found you. Don't. Okay. So, um, now it's southwest or due west. You know, in the season, there are more alligator hunters down here than... than... alligators. Maybe you can take a photograph of one of them, then. Very droll. There was even a tour company that let excursionists shoot from the deck of a paddle steamer, chugged up the waterways and churned whole bayous into mud. Thankfully, the state legislator put a stop. A paddle steamer, huh? Now, why didn't we think of that? In the cane rake. That's a likely spot for one. There, in the channel. You see its head? Poking up there. Line us up to it. Excellent. Beast in repose. All as calm as the predator lurks. The final sighting was to the northwest of here. 17 feet, 19 feet, 21 feet with a five foot head. What? They found some big bulls in these parts. Surely they did. There's 20-foot gators here, and us two idiots are sitting in a 12-foot skiff? No. This is in the 70s, 80s. All the really big gators have been hunted out and killed. More the shame, I say. It's terrible. It ain't shame to this rolling fool who values his arm <laughs> being attached to his body. It's them or us, especially with the big ones. I want to go the other way. Where are you going? I'm trying to push the boat around.
Ah, yes. Yes, there. Oh, no, he's gone. Ah. Can you stop the boat just there, off the island? Sure. If we stop too long, locals are gonna start getting curious. Just, just there, please. So, so I'm facing the landmass. Right. Now look, there's an alligator back in those palms. Could you, could you run in there and coax him out? Coax him? Please, he's quite something. If I could take that fellow's likeness, it might, it might just save him from the taxidermist. <sighs> Fine. Maybe I want this monster stuffed in on display. That's the spirit. Out you go, Eddie. Get him and uh, get him in notice. You and then turn. I'm eating. I hope he eats you too. Oh, he's awake. Get him back here, quick. I hope you're slow. Quick, jump in the boat. In, 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 in. Got him. What a specimen. Nearly got him eating me. <laughs> I don't know what I'd do without you, sir. I really don't. We can congratulate ourselves on a job well done, Mr. Morgan. Take us back where we began. Anyway. I hope you got something worth printing. Oh, surely. The nation will see these beautiful beasts for what they are. Killing machines? <laughs> no. Well, yes. Maybe that's not a bad thing. This is America, after all. We hold a love for killers that borders on macabre. Loving killers is part of our makeup. Maybe. Maybe. But usually we wait until after they're dead. Well, I hope we've changed. Me too. Ah, yes. Docker here. Just pull up to the bank. That should do us. Yes. These pictures you're taking. Yes. They gonna be any good? Oh, I certainly hope so. Though I doubt it. The subject is magnificent. The backdrop, jaw-dropping. But the agent of beauty is a talentless fool. Although maybe I'll strike a few lucky shots. You sure do make me laugh that way you talk about yourself, Mr. Mason. Well, I'm good for laughing at, if nothing else. I didn't mean it like that. I know. Still, I feel such a fool around you, sir. Don't worry about it. Oh. I foresaw many an ignominious future for myself, but never damsel in distress. Well, uh, good luck, Mr. Mason. Thank you, and to you too, sir. Try and stay out of trouble. I shall certainly try. Weapons forbidden. What? Let's go ahead and do John's stuff. Yeah. 
please, friend. You gotta help me out here. Come on, please. I'm about done here. If I don't get these shackles off soon, I'm a goner. Save. Please. This is crazy. Just shoot the shackles. One bullet, that's all. There you go. Oh. oh, thank God. Oh, well, I waited to hear that noise for so long. Yeah, I bet. I, I wish I could give you some money or... Well, you know, I might have something of interest. You know Ansberg? Well, some la di da rich folks bought up a little cabin up north of there. Very remote. You get me? You sure I'm the right person for this sort of information? I ain't saying nothing. Do with it what you will. Just keep out of sight for a bit. Oh, I intend to.
now, boy. me I sense bad energy returning stay away uh, I have high honor your stench precedes you stay away from me Whoa, did I just crash? Hello, mister. How you doing, friend? Hey, buddy! Hey, mister! Mister! I never learned your name. I never did. You're like a brother. But I didn't learn your name. And I said to myself, Mickey, you never learned that fella's name. Now, you'll never see him again. And you'll be sad. Like when your puppy passed. Because you slept on it. What's your name, mister? 
Arthur. Arthur? My uncle's name was Arthur. Uncle Arthur, we called him on account of his name. You're cringing so it's hard over there, aren't you, Arthur? A strong name. Like a king. You could be my king, Mr. Arthur. Oh, God. Yes, you could. Make it stop. Just hold her up a minute there. There's something up with this one. I can tell. Look at this fake. Careful, everybody. Whatever you come looking for ain't here. Clear these streets. And what you gonna do if I don't? That's the last straw. Try harden that. Have a look. I believe we're up to two shoots. You love it. It's yours now. It's a nice piece and all, but I'd personally add some rifling. Take it or leave it. I bet this will shoot better with some new sights. You want to make this really yours? Give it a personal engraving. I do quite a lot of blacksmith work in here, too. Don't mind the clutter. That's it for now. I guess I did there just ain't no way into fine tuning your gun, you know? Good. Ain't no trace of rust on that as far as I can see. You keep treating that like your own child, all right? Good on you. Hey, beautiful condition. Keep it up. Good. Ain't no trace of rust on that as far as I can see. You keep treating that like your own child, all right? Good on you. Hey, it's beautiful condition. Keep it up. Good. Ain't no trace of rust on that as far as I can see. You keep treating that like your own child, all right? Good on you. Yeah, 
that looks better. Hey, beautiful condition. Keep it up. I'd just like to give this a personal touch with some engraving. Jacob Worth is a friend of mine. I admire him, but he's just about the worst poker player in all of Valentine. Don't listen to the folk around here. I do not and will not ever do arms business with no gang. How about you get some new sites for this, huh? You'll be very pleased with this. You keep treating that like your own child, all right? Good on you. Old Crawford at Carmody Dell had a wagon stolen from his barn. Ain't sure it was his to start with, mind you. Thank you for your help. Ah. I need my ammo back. I need more ammo. Don't, don't feel quite armed team. enough to go back out there? Let's, Let's have, have a look. look. <laughs> good, good. You need anything else, let me know. Thanks, partner. Let's get to the main act. I've done ten minutes ago. 
go and had time to clean my boots. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Man. Oh god, that what is that? What is he in bullshit? So, feeling better? How's the scar? I heal pretty fast. Lucky you. So you just lazing about or you got any leads? I got something. You see them? Sure. Well, you see yourself as a shepherd now? Maybe. Come on. Well, where exactly are we going? Collect something. Help us get some sheep. Uh, you know, that attempt to seem all enigmatic and interesting, that might work for Dutch, but for you, it just makes you look stupid. Come along. You'll see. That train job was a start, but we need more money. Until we can get back to Blackwater and collect. I'm here to tell you. If we try to collect that money anytime soon, it'll come with a noose. I was worried you'd say that. Dutch says that we... Dutch says a lot. That's his gift. Saying things. Oh, yeah? What do you mean by that? I was a prize pony once. Now I'm a workhorse. Listen, Dutch is... But... But, well... You was at that thing in Blackwater. We already seen Pinkertons here. New century's coming. This life, this way... Well... We're the last, I reckon. And we ain't long for it. Then that's the way it goes, I guess. For me, yes. All right. So where are we going? Just need to pick up something. There's a hitching post over there. Tether the horse and I'll meet you across the street. Uh, I already don't like how this is going. Gun store. Yep. Can you uh head in, pick up the sniper rifle? I'll explain later. Go on. We just need something with a scope on it. Finally! I want a long scope. I shouldn't have just spent all my money.
good? Sure. Let's go. You've got some real sand come back here. I got my eye on you. I'm reformed. Good to see Manners ain't dead yet. Hey, boy. Why couldn't you have done that? Done what? Bought that gun. I had a run in with that fella earlier. We ain't on the best of terms. You had a run in. I've had a run in with half that town. Calm down. It's done now, ain't it? Why are you being so cagey about all this? Always playing some goddamn game. Me? I ain't the one taking Jack on fishing trips. No, you ain't. If you say the boy ain't yours, what's the difference? You probably only run off again. Why are you so interested in my life? Ain't you got one of your own? Just do one thing or another. Not be two people at once, that's all I'm saying. It ain't that simple. You know that as well as anyone. Same as with you and that girl... What was her name, Mary? That was different. No, it ain't. Just the same. Anyway, for the love of God, will you tell me what you got me doing here before I turn around and hit the breeze? There's a herd of sheep coming down to auction from Emerald Ranch. Folk in town were saying the owner's trying to stamp out every farm from here to Ansburg. Yeah, I know that place. Too much. Why we need this rifle you couldn't buy yourself. Reckon we shouldn't get too close. At least not till we know what we're dealing with. Let's see what we can see from up here. No hightailing. They're only ranch hands. Just watch the sheep. Well, looks like one of them don't scare too easy. Put another shot in close. He'll get the message. Yep, that spooked him all right. All right, let's go round them up. Okay, so you do slightly more damage. Right, let's go. Let's go get the strays. You ever work on... Marston? No. You? Oh, day here, there, but not much. Most cowboys I know are dumb as trees. How hard could it be? I guess we'll soon find out. Let's get these things. Bring them back to the yards. They're pretty scattered. Let's 
head to town. You know what? Marston, why don't you leave the sheep to me? You ride Shank, keep watch for any trouble. I brought you in on this. It'll be quicker this way. Trust me. This ain't the right time for you to be learning how to hurt. All right, whatever you say. I'm done arguing. That's it. The quickest route back to Valentine is right around that mountain. Okay. Like I said, I'll handle this. Those are up, boys. There you go. Fine sheep. They're okay. Well, you seen better around here? I've seen ones with less ambiguity about their provenance. <laughs> A lot less. What are you trying to say? I'm trying to say you give me 25% kickback, and I won't say nothing to nobody. Everything all right here? Excuse me? Sure, I'll excuse you for 25%. Do you want me to put another hole in your head? Folks swing for rustling livestock. 25%. 15. 20. 18. Done. Calm yourself, friend. Just think of it as I'm buying your sins. Uh, you're buying, but we're paying. Go on now. Come back after the auction. You'll get your money. Dutch is waiting for us at the saloon. He is? Uh, yeah! 18%. I thought we was doing the robbing here. Still good money. Well, thanks for all the help with this. Can't herd, can't swim. Give it a rest, will you? We ain't kids no more. No, we never really was. Whoa! Come on, sunshine. I'll buy you a... In the end, I don't believe in absolutes, just shades of... Uh, gentlemen. Dutch, Meepo, where have you been? 
Working. Marston's thing. Good. And? We're just waiting to get some pay on a few sheep. Leopold, my good friend, as long as you're here, why don't you and John go make sure there ain't no funny business? Of course. Gentlemen. Drink? Sure. <clears throat> Nothing like talking to old Strauss to make you want to blow your own brains out. I should have left him where I found him all those years ago, bookish little Austrian, fresh off the boat, his eyes out on stalks. Well, I guess the Dutch Vanderlyn finishing school has some strange graduates. That it does. To your good health. Thank you. No. Vanderlyn! Get out here! Get out what here the now! Hell? You don't know me, but you keep robbing me. My name is Leviticus Cornwall. I am not a man to be messed with by the likes of you. Get out here before I have these men killed. What do you think? Get out here, well, I... you depraved piece of trash. You start spinning a yarn. When I think the moment's you right, I'll make a move. You think I got where I am by letting Scott like you rob from me? Vandalin, you're yep. done. Get to break in my new pistols. Now. Deal with this nonsense. Please, gentlemen, this is a terrible mistake. This is a case of mistaken identity. What is worse than admonishing a man for the sins of another who wants to be the Messiah? Shut up! You 
Jason's over there! Come on, Brad Strauss! Nobody's following us. We'll get back to camp. We're gonna gather the troops and get them to start packing up. Ugh. Sure. We can't stick around after this. Let's go! <laughs> I gotta make a break for it. Dead or alive, just keep spreading.
That was a bit of an attempt gun, but... Got this horsey, don't fall. So you took an hour and a half of stream, with the two and a half hour, I'll do one more. That's probably Valentine then. I see you got a new revolver. So we keep heading east. Is that the plan? All right. Well. And when do we stop? When we reach Paris? Well, that'd be nice. Join the commune. We stop when we find someplace sensible. Shake them that's following us and lie low. This is lying low? We turned into a bunch of killers. I mean it. We ain't even got the delusion of being anything but a bunch of killers. We are just trying to survive, Hosea. Hello, Mr. We don't have a choice. This will end soon. Damn right it will. Constipated as usual. So, we moving? Yeah. Micah told me of a place we can lie low. Look here. Dewberry Creek, he said. Okay. Maybe you and Charles can go take a look, clear off anyone you find before the whole lot of us move in looking so conspicuous. And how are we gonna do that? I don't know. Start dancing? Looks like I turned into a goddamn errand boy. You have turned into my son. You worry because I worry. We are just the same. Charles, come with me. We got work to do. Sure, this can wait. Let's go, boy. Dewberry Creek. Oh, God. spot to camp. We're packing up and moving on. Again? We have to. And fast. 
We'd already pushed our luck too far before that mess we just made in Valentine. Ah, uh, that didn't sound good. Uh, killed a lot of law. Hit a lot of Cornwall's men. They must know where we are by now. So, we're heading south? Yeah. Area called Dewberry Creek. Dutch wants us to give it a look. Make sure it's clear and a good place to lie low for a while. I've only known him a few months, but the way he talks, I never thought I'd see him wanting to head south. Right. And I know by now, there ain't no lying low. There's too many of us for that. And there ain't no way Dutch is gonna just hide away in a cave somewhere. Goes against everything he stands for. That'd be admitting we're nothing more than low-down criminals. Which we are. You don't have to tell me. So where does it end? Where does what end? The moving, the running. Dutch don't see it as running. Call it what you want. I don't know. Before, put enough time and distance between you and the problem, eventually it went away. I mean, this is a big country. But now, with these Pinkertons, better paid bounty hunters, I ain't so sure. Maybe the price on our heads got too big. Yeah, they've certainly got money behind them. They've got Cornwall's money behind them for one, which guarantees even more trouble. up ahead. The old dried up creek. Seems very open. Yeah, it does. Ain't sure to be the best in the rain, neither. Well, let's take a look around. Hey, I see something over there. You see it? Someone on the ground there. Oh, that's not good. He's been shot. Let's be careful out there. Hmm. There's a camp just up ahead. Sure. Let's get ready for business. All right, Charles, let's go take a look. Look, here it is. A few tents, but it looks empty. Let's have a look around and make sure. Where is everybody? Maybe they heard us come. Be careful. And being careful. Sure about that. I'll be damned near good. That camp was attacked. But you said clear it! I see something over there. He's been shot. Let's be careful, Arthur. 
Hmm. There's a camp just up ahead. Sure. Let's get ready for business. Any issues? Shoot first, debate second. I'm not gonna shoot for the sake of it. Survival's for the sake of it. Quit talking. You started it. Ah. You really have to do that? You don't need it now. You see there? Tents and a wagon. Looks deserted. Okay, well, let's have a look around and make sure. Where is everybody? Maybe they heard us coming. Be careful. I'm being careful. Okay. Come out of there. You okay? You don't mean no harm. He said, are you okay? Sprechen Sie Deutsch? German? No. Now go on. Get out of here. Go. We need the land. Go. Get the hell out of they here. They took our father. Who did? Men. Last night. Where? Where did they take him? It ain't no business of ours. I don't even speak their language. You ain't as tough and dense as all that. Come on, Arthur. The girl was pointing this way. Let's see if we can pick up a trail. There. Tracks. Come on. I don't yeah, see nothing. Yeah, that looks oh, better. This way. What's going on with you? What do you mean? You were just going to send that woman and her children on their way? We're wanted, man. We got Pinkertons breeding down our necks. We should be moving camp, not running off on some wild goose chase. Come on, Arthur. That's not how you are. Well, maybe you don't know me as well as you think you do. Wait a second. Just want to look closer here. Looks like they go down this way. So, what happened with those Pinkertons anyway? When you were fishing with Jack? Said they were on to us. Offered me freedom if I turned Dutch in. They picked the wrong man there. We should have moved right then, if you ask me. Wait, just let me make sure this is right. Continues along the shore here. Anyway, you were saying? Bastards told me they killed Mac. Said it right in front of Jack. Ah, uh, that kid. It's gonna be tough for him. Yeah, but he has more folk looking out for him than most of the rest of us had growing up. John said he was going back to the auction yard to collect the money for those sheep. He'd be a damn idiot going anywhere near that town right now. Uh, he reckoned he'd be able to slip in and out. Oh, well, 
If it's John's idea, it must be a good one. What is it with you and him? Uh, he disappeared on us for a while. When Jack was real young, a long while. Hear him. Think this is the right way? Give me a second. They carry on along this trail. So you was just talking about something? You did? And we was family, you know? Guess I still ain't fully forgiven him for that. There's a camp up ahead. Be careful. Seems deserted. Let's take a look. What are you doing? Oh, yes, I'd let's take Wrong a look. About. Hold it. Where is this guy? I don't know. But you know something? This is a better camp spot than back there. Much easier to defend. Maybe. That's fresh there game. Quick, cut him free and let's get out of here. Vorsicht, Vorsicht! Das ist eine Pfanne Vorsicht! Take cover! I see three coming this way! What the hell do you think you're... Okay, getting you out of here. Vielen Dank für Ihre Hilfe. Yeah, okay. Hey, you wait there a second. Oh, go find Dutch. Get the caravan to divert here. This spot should work for us. I agree. Get back to your family. Vielen Dank für Ihre Hilfe. Also soll ich mitkommen? Got some scenery right there. Wo bringen Sie mich hin? What the hell did you do to those fellas? Wie bitte? Those men back there. Why did they take you? Geld, money. Meiner Familie gehört eine Goldmine. Sie wollen Lösegeld erpressen. How did someone even come up with them words? 
Sie bringen mich zu meiner Familie? Vielen Dank. Wie haben Sie sie gefunden? Uh, I'm sorry, friend. I can barely speak English. Dem Herrgott sei Dank. Schatz! Oh. Andreas, Andreas, ich hab gedacht, du seist tot. Beinahe wäre es so gewesen. Meine Lieblinge, meine Herz allerliebst. Oh, wie wunderbar. Oh. Sie sind ein großer Mann. Ja. Ein großer Mann. Ja, wirklich. Es ist ein Segen, dass Thanks. wir sie getroffen haben. Come on, now get out of here. This place ain't safe. Get out of here! Ja, ja, Bramble. alles klar. Bramble. Uh, ich hab was für Sie. Einen Moment. Uh, ähm. Dankeschön. Thank you. Vielen Dank, herzlichen Dank. Guess it was a pleasure. Ja! Whole last gold bar, ja? Yeah? This place, oh, it'll be perfect for us. Hello, Arthur. Dutch. <clears throat> Miss Grimshaw, Mr. Pearson, put everyone to work. Make this place a home. Well, I don't know where the hell we are, but we are going to make the best of it. We'll go over here and talk to freaking weirdo mother weirdo number two. Hey, mister! Remember me? Come on over! How you doing today? Well, yeah, you see this here? American ginseng. Take a feller from not too bad to hardy as buck in no time. Really something. 
Yep, you don't find this every day. Dose this in your medicine, give it some zip. Believe me. Whatever you're selling, I ain't buying. Anyway, I ain't gonna use all of this, so feel free to help yourself to whatever's left. You take care now. Oh, thanks. Be well, friend. Come on now, boy. Just minding my own business. Get out of here now, damn you! Don't pull that trigger. Ain't no one will cry if I shoot you dead. <laughs> I told you not to do it. Nothing there. Yep. Hey there, mister.
Jesus! Oh, God! I gotta, gotta grab something for for the blood. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, I was uh, done for you. Say to me. Thank you. <laughs> Take something from my back for the trouble. Though. I'm. Uh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna take a take a minute now. My leg feels like it's like it's on fire. Oh, that's gonna be nasty. Yeah. Boy. And the thing. I almost didn't bring the trap. Maybe don't use traps in the future. You're gonna kill it, kill it dead, kill it rat. I want to try something. And I know it's gonna lose my karma. It will! One varmint rifle ran into the head will kill. Can I help you? Just taking a look. We're with the Appleseed Timber Company. Head foreman. We're still getting started on this site, but we should have some 
fine big valley lumber for sale very soon if you're interested. I'll keep that in mind. We should be further along by now, but what can you do? I mean, <laughs> look at these dopes. There's not a brain between them. Listen, you got any supplies for sale? Food, medicine? Starting to run low. I can't spare anyone to go into town. Not the way things are going. I'd be happy to pay premium for them. Appreciate it. That should help keep us going. Huh. Hey. Hello, mister. Hello. Damn, lunatic! Yep. Exactly, is this fucking nut job? to see you. Why? You want rescuing again, dear? <laughs> no. I got a plan to make it up to you. A oh, plan like the Blackwater Ferry job, or like you going off scouting and ending up in jail? <laughs> Dutch said you was a, a big shadow cast by a tiny tree. I don't even know what that means. Mm. <laughs> I thought you was a tough boy. <laughs> Not one of those gentlemen. <laughs> Trying to protect his riding clothes. Well, I just know whenever things get real, you turn yellow and lose your head. Yellow? Sure seems that way. So I guess you won't be riding with me to rob the banking coach comes about this time in the strawberry. I heard one of the O'Driscoll boys yapping about it while I was inside. You and me? Do a robbery? That's what I said, didn't I? After you. <laughs> Come on. I know an overlook where we can watch for them coming in. What? What are you doing anyway, camping out here like some crazy hermit? Can't exactly stay in town now, can I? Like I told you, I ain't going back to Dutch without a peace offering. So what's the deal with this coach? What do you mean? Comes through about this time every day, like I said, the end. I mean, how many men? Guns. Riders. Nothing serious. You'll be fine. I heard the bank's been hiring every trigger man they can get of late. The meaner, the better. You worry too much. Forgive me if I ain't wholly faithful in something an old Driscoll told you when you was half drunk in a jail cell. He kept yapping about it, saying how they've been hitting it on the regular. That's a good lead in my book. 
Damn old Triscolls are everywhere now. Bastards got a hold of most of Big Valley. Heard they took over some big ranch north of here. What are you doing back there? Let's go, let's. For you to join me. What was you jawing about before? How the hell you and Lenny end up down here, anyway? Oh, you know how it is? A few loose ends, drink here, drink there. What loose ends? Nothing that needs to concern you. I always pay my share. It concerns me when you put us in danger and we don't realize till it's too late. Like that move you pulled in Strawberry. Making me kill half the town just for your precious guns. Okay, Arthur, I, I have to agree. Off. You need to roll a little looser, Morgan. Looser? I seen you come full undone more than once now, and you only been running with us a few months. Are we gonna rob this coach or bicker about it? What's done is done. Guess we're robbing it. Then let's do it. So far, the only thing I agree with Micah on is I would, if somebody took all these guns, I would go ape shit and slaughter the whole town to get them back. I do love my guns. All right, this is the spot. Hold up on this ridge. They should be here in a little bit. Hold tight. Which way will they be coming in? Should be from over there. We need to hit them fast before they get into town. Just don't lose your head this time. Of course, tough guy. They should be here any minute. Look, there they are. Right on time. Get covered up. Come on! <laughs> Ride! Yeah. Pass right through Dutch. Good. Or not Dutch, Micah. Let's get this out of here. No need to keep your face covered now. It's just you and me, sweetheart. Are you getting on? I am on. How long does it take? Next, leave you in the dust. I'm hoping there won't be a next time. <laughs> you don't mean... Yeah! Come on, boy! From me to you, that's more your style than mine. Okay. Dutch, I mean, not Dutch. Micah, quit I doing things that make me approve. Something like that. You don't want to just break it open here and be done with it. Could be more than we can carry. And there might be a second crew of riders tailing. All right. Yeah. Not to mention. We arrive back in with a big take and a new wagon to boot. Dutch can't say we ain't pulling our weight no more, can he? 
I ain't sure I trust this new act of yours one bit. Listen, I know we got off on the wrong foot, but I got no beef with you. I reckon we're a lot alike, you and me. Now, hold up there. Dutch knows I'm a feller that gets things done, same as you. Gets things done? You'd be wearing a California collar now if I hadn't broken you out of jail. And I have expressed my gratitude, have I not? It's done. Main thing now is getting this haul back in one piece. Dead bodies. Since when did you have a problem killing old Christmas? Huh, huh. There you go, boy. Yes, yeah, see. They clearly ain't going nowhere now. You know, we should really pick up a lock breaker one of these days. Save ourselves some bullets. Yeah, because saving bullets is such a concern of yours. Hey, give me a hand with this, will you? Once I get up in saluting all these damn bodies. It's gonna be like a hundred bucks on all these bodies.
both of those bodies have been looted. Let's take what we can and get the hell out of here. That lock should shoot off easy enough. I'll give you the honor. On account of, well, this little mess. That should do it. Come on, let's see if all this was worth it. All I see is you, me, a river full of dead O'Driscolls, and a lockbox. I'd say we're golden here, Morgan. Look at that. What's the cut here? It's good. Just make sure the gang gets its piece. Yeah, yeah. Like I said, big shadow. Tiny tree. And like I said, that still don't mean nothing. Get out of here. Go see Dutch. Make sure you ain't followed. I know, boss. I know. It's been fun. That was a fun mission. <sighs> Time to go, boy. Easy! Jostling each other, everyone will board. Welcome, welcome. That's quite a sum. I hope you learned your lesson. Nope. Thanks for your assistance.
bad sorts here. I took a little jolt in a face to get myself hopelessly lost. I am staying in Strawberry. If you could just guide me back. Can't think of a good reason to say no. Oh, thank you, thank you, sir. Well, after you. What possessed me to come out here, I'll never know. <laughs> What are you doing out here, anyway? It clearly ain't your natural habitat. I don't uh, know. I'm just visiting. Uh, I, I'm from New York City, actually. You don't say. Oh, yes. There was some talk at the country club about this burgeoning little resort town called Strawberry. So I thought it might be quite the trip to see what all the fuss was. Perhaps make a few investments while it was still undervalued. Turns out I was made the fool. Not enjoying it, Dan? It's a town of splinters, if you could call it much of a town at all. I'd hardly stepped off the carriage and I'd taken in the whole place. I suppose some might call it charming. <laughs> Let me tell you, charm is not worth much these days. You show me a timber frame shack and I'll show you Broadway. There you, know you have shit. this mayor, a quite intolerable blowhard, a little bes spoke woodwork and he thinks this is a cultural hub? The man's completely deluded. Well, I should give him some credit. He must be quite the salesman. He did get me out here after all. More fool me. Now I'm tromping through the leaves in the muck with some cowboy. Uh, no, no offense. Little taken. Oh, yes, this does look familiar. If you're wondering why I'm walking, this guy won't get on a horse, and if you bump him, he'll straight up stop. Resourceful sort, sir. If for some reason you plan to spend any time in Strawberry, you may want to look into that gabbing mayor. Something is definitely off with him. All right. I'll keep that in mind. Maybe stay in town for now, huh? A rock and a hard place. Thanks anyway. Uh, New Yorkers. Jesus. <laughs> they only get worse, Arthur. They only get worse. I never thought I'd be so happy to see this pulp heap. This town's probably not going to be very happy to see me. Good morning, sir. Let's do it. Thank you. Come again. Yeah. Hey, you got people waiting on you. How's everything? Get up! Good to have you. You 
must travel a lot if you've made it all the way over here. Now grab some items for your camp. Coffee, hunting supplies, biscuits, canned items. All along the perimeter of the shop. Well, let me see then. Sure. Uh-huh. Deal. Much appreciated. Lighten's my load. Still recovering from that day. Lost a lot of folks. At least the jail's fixed now. Thank you. Careful there. Hey, nice ahead, friend. Hey, move it already. Oh, you're back so soon? After a bounty? I can tell. If so, we got a poster on the wall just there. Hmm. Well, well. Word is, he's made a home out of an old mine up in the Big Valley Mountains. But you might want to leave that one on the wall. Josh Brown would be a hard man to kill, let alone capture. And that's what we're asking for. Got half the bounty hunters in the state out looking for him. I want your advice. I'll ask for it, okay? Okay. Joshua Brown. Give it to me. He's a killer. Got away with it for the most part, too. Legal kills. But if you walk that line, you're gonna step over it at some point, And that way he done. If this man's dangerous, why I gotta bring him in alive? He brought us some bounties in the past, and he's always been decent. If you don't want to bring him in breathing, you leave this alone. I figure I know what I gotta do. Happy hunting. Okay, fella. I'm surprised I don't have more bounty hunters on me. Anytime I was trying to do something before, they were always on me. Just like no, no give. I figure I'll probably call it once this mission's done. It's 5.30 in the morning. I gotta be going to bed soon, but not immediately.
Oh, we got ourselves a cutscene. Dead end. <laughs> you got nowhere to go, bounty hunter. I ain't here to kill you. <laughs> Wouldn't matter if you were. There's only one way out of here, and that's through me. Come easy. I'll say something to the law. <laughs> It ain't gonna be easy. You're gonna have to draw on me to get me out. You might have found me, but you won't beat me, bounty hunter. Oh! You fast! Oh, you're gonna be hard. Try shooting him in the leg. God damn bounty hunt, son of a bitch! Damn you! Damn this! How many rounds did I put into his leg? Is that about your kneecap? It'll never work right again. Out of your hands now, mister. Let's tie up that shooting arm. We're going back to Strawberry. and say to do it right. You duel a man and you ought to put him down. Not knock him out and tie him up. You got no decency, bounty hunter. Younger days, I would have put one in the middle of your eyes before you even blink. You did you twice. Ain't special, and you ain't gonna stay sharp for very long. None of us do. That's Big Josh, all right. Hey, he looks heavy. Can we take that bounty off of you? I can manage him fine. Yep. Are you trying You're to chase popular, me? Ain't you? I'm all yours. <laughs> 
Five rounds to the face, literally split, and to scare other people off. I wish you killed me back there. A real man would have killed me. A real man wouldn't tie me like this. A real man wouldn't take me in. Sells here are really comfortable. You trying to be winsome, bounty hunter? Always. I'm a regular charmer. Come on. Got Brown here. Ah, Mr. Brown. Come on now. Make him comfortable downstairs. Get about me. All right, about that sir. This business. Now, leave me to my peace. Pay's right here. You make you work for it? He dueled me, so I'd say that's a yes. <laughs> Look. Honest to be. I want to keep going. I should be smart and call it a night. As it's already 5.30, sun's going to be rising in about 30 minutes, and I'm going to be up for work for 2.30. That's not when I walk my dog. Oh, 40.8% completion of the whole game. Main story is 23%. Total completion 40. Okay. It's called a night.